All right, the second thing that we're going to install here onto our motherboard is the RAM, okay? I personally bought a tri-channel motherboard, which means you need at least three sticks of RAM on this motherboard. Um, that means I can either put up like uh, three, three gigs, um, what, like three gigs and up, all right, basically. Or maybe even half a gig, no, nah, whatever, but I splurged and bought three sticks of two gigabytes each. So I have six megabyte, I mean six gigs of RAM. Okay, and I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to install. All right, so pretty much every motherboard is going to be different. There's a certain order that the manufacturer recommends you put the sticks in to get the best performance out of them. Okay, in this case on my board, um, Asus recommends that I put the three sticks on the three orange ones first, okay? And then if I have four sticks, then it'll tell me in the instruction manual where to go from there, okay? So, I'm going to install the three sticks on the orange ones for the best performance. Uh, socket A1, to, uh, B1, and C1. Alright, um, basically, this is a very easy install. See this, like, little notch here? Right there? You're going to line it up with that one right there. Right, so let me just go ahead and show you. Just go ahead and slide this in, like that, and then it lines up. Then you just press down until this right here clicks in. There you go. Okay, and we're just going to go ahead and uh, install all three of them. One moment. Let's see if I can get a better camera angle really quick. If not, then well, I try. All right. You see? I'm going to open up my second, my second stick right here. <laughs> Keep messing up with my words. Okay. This is actually XMS three. RAM, okay, and there you see the specs of it, okay. When choosing your RAM, make sure you're careful of how many volts your RAM is, okay. See how you can see this like lining up right there, that notch. See how many volts your RAM is because your motherboard can only handle so much, okay. So, yeah, you'll have to read your manual, your motherboard's manual to know that. And then you can also, when buying RAM, you can check to see how many uh, volts your RAM is. See, when I set it up, I get the side, and there's like a little slot you put in right here at the tip. Okay, I just pretty much line it up with that, put in that slot, and on the other side, put it in this slot. And then I just push down, and it guides me in. It's very easy. Click and click. Okay, Very, very simple. Uh, RAM is probably my favorite install because it's the easiest, but important. Okay, so there you go. That's how you install RAM.